we will get started here in just a few seconds to give everybody just a few more minutes to get logged in and set up. And then we're going to be a little bit on roller skates because we have so much that um, we want to share with you all. Um, behind the camera, you can hear my voice. Uh, I am Comer Ware, I'm Vice President of Marketing for Century Furniture and for Highland House Brands, and also granddaughter of Harley Ferguson Schubert, who founded Century. Um, and so I'm excited to be with you all today, but I'll be behind the camera and you get to hear from our Vice President of Sales, Guy Holbrook, and our Vice President of Merchandising, Chuck Auten. Um, we've got our Century Details Cabinets program that we want to share with you, which is what the screen is showing right now. And then we will quickly move to our Great Rooms program, which is a beautiful new upholstery program that we just launched. And then we'll also quickly highlight our Details Live Edge program, which is another configurable program we just launched um, that features Live Edge or slab top dining tables, cocktail tables, and consoles. So with no further ado, let me introduce you. This is Guy Holbrook, Century Furniture's Vice President of Sales. And he is going to talk about our Details Custom Cabinet Program. Well, first and foremost, thank you everyone for taking some time to spend a little time here with Century and our team. Uh, on behalf of 800 people at Century Furniture in Hickory, North Carolina, we wanna welcome you. We've got a lot of things, just beautiful product to share with you and some great faces. So as Comer mentioned, I'm Guy Holbrook, VP of Sales, Comer Ware. Uh, Vice President of Marketing, obviously, uh, fantastic teammate, also one of Century and Rockhouse Farm, our parent company's owner. So she's going to do a little bit of videoing of us today, and we'll introduce Chuck Alton, uh, who is our Vice President of Merchandising a little bit later. And Chuck has been referring to himself as the talent all day. So the talent needs his hair done. The talent needs his nails done. So uh, I've got a face for radio. So let me tell you a little bit about what we're doing. Um, the program I'm going to explain to you today is Century's Details. Details for us is our highly configurable case good product. We have a wonderful moniker that we put over all of our highly configurable product that we call Source, S-O-U-R-C-E, as in we are the source for highly configurable product at Century. Details for us allows us to take the best things that we do best and deliver it in a customizable but easy to configure way. 100% made in America. We talk a lot about being makers at Century Furniture, and this product is built 100% in Hickory, North Carolina. Details is a bedroom and dining room, and as well as now even a great room, family room, case good off. We offer nightstands, we offer dressers, we offer credenzas, and so I'm going to show you a little bit about the construction here. All of these cases are built in maple solids and maple veneers. So we build this in maple for a couple reasons. One, it allows us to do some great painted finishes on this as well. So we work with Sherwin Williams and Benjamin Moore. But let me show you, this is our 24 inch three bay case. So we have three drawers in this. Just unique things about this is we have a full extension drawer right here. Many people don't do a full extension. They do a two third extension because of the tip over constraints they're worried about. We put an extra thick back panel in this that allows us to get our drawer all the way out, easy access to the back and then under mount glide. So if you look over here on the sides, you won't see any type of glides or any metal on the side. We do it all under mount and we use bloom glides, which are the high end glides used in kitchen cabinetry. So a nice silky soft smooth close on all of these. These are eight way adjustable, allowing for configurability in the field by your design and installation teams. So this is the 24 inch nightstand. We also offer this up in a 30 inch nightstand. We've got a 36 inch nightstand, as well as a 40 inch chest that we sometimes term as a California or a Texas scale. And here is that. And again, just showcasing all the configurability in here from hardwares to this is actually a wire brushed maple allowing for ceruse finishing in through here. You'll see some of our hardware options up here on the board above it. We've got about 25 hardware options, including things that are a little bit more dressy, as well as things that are a little bit more casual. Century, of course, only uses the highest of end materials from the acrylic to the, uh, to the cast brass and even the ham hammered metals that we have in through. And beyond our hardware, I wanna make sure that people understand, Century does our own wood finishing. So we have over 80 wood finishes that we offer up on all of our case goods. In addition to the Sherwin-Williams and Benjamin Moore and any paint color that you'd like, we also do custom finish matching. 
We have a wonderful array here of different striping techniques, as well as dry brushing techniques, as well as some just painted and pigmented striping that actually can accent these cases. So a lot of different finishing capabilities, and we're always happy to send you a strike off for a small upcharge. Showing you a little bit wider array of the bedroom, our new 30 inch uh, nightstand over here to the far left with a little bit prettier hardware on this with a great little back uh, plate. Again, same features kind of working back with this full extension drawers. And this is really a cool feature. We've had a lot of people ask about a nice little open cavity right here. And you'll see a cool little cutout right here in the back allowing for your power cords to come through. Therefore, you can put your iPad or your phone, anything that needs charging down here and allow the upper space here for lamps or things that you would put up top. Coming over, we're showing a little bit more uh, updated hardware in the casual. So this is actually a hammered metal, a little bit of a striated look on this. Homer's gonna get you a nice uh, close up of that, showing that you can take this case a little bit more rustic. Uh, if you're up in the Whistler area or somewhere like that, that maybe has a little bit more of a lodge feel, you can put an oak veneer face on this for that wire brush. And then we can also take this beautifully feminine very quickly, do a little reeded face here with a, pewter, a real pretty uh, brass pull. You can do these pulls in double and tandem on each drawer, or if you just wanted a center row of these instead of it double for each drawer, we can do that as well. Lead times currently for the details case goods are running about eight to 12 weeks production. Obviously it takes a little bit longer to get out to the West Coast from Hickory, North Carolina, but um, it does allow us to control our production. So these are stocked cases. We have 20 different faces we put on here. I think there's about 18 different legs that we put on there in different faces. And I'll show you how we've kind of stepped into the family room with this. So we've shown you the bedroom with the nightstands and the dressers. We do two scales of the nightstand or actually two scales of the dresser and four scales of the nightstand. This is our details bar. Just showcasing our finishing here. We have a contrast finish on the door as well as on the case, the beautiful little pendant pulls here. This opens up to a lovely case, mirrored backs, adjustable glass shelving in through here, European cup hinges, again, high-end construction uh, that is synonymous with Century. You've got these wonderful magnetic catches, and of course, another full extension drawer with a soft closed bloom glass underneath. Great polished nickel base on this. Typically for us, if we're offering metal, we're offering this in both a warm and a cool. So we'll typically have a little bit of a gold as well as a polished nickel as well or brass, usually a little bit more muted. The other thing we've seen emerging is the need for storage in the family or great room. And the great room for us is now the place where people congregate, uh, it's where they're hosting their parties and so on. Now, this is a 72 inch case that we offer up in details. And this is uh, asymmetrical, obviously. We're offering up this with door storage here on this side. And then over here, we have the drawer storage. So, this is a two bay case, one bay of drawers, one bay of doors. We also do this as a three bay case. So, imagine one more bay right where I'm standing. And that makes this a 108 inch credenza. And we absolutely have sold a ton of these. People now have these great giant TVs. This is only like a 60 inch TV, but we now have people with the 85 and 90 inch and 100 inch TVs. These are wonderful pieces that you would want and be proud of to put up in the front of your room. Now with Century, I wanna make sure people understand we've got a great marketing department that does a ton of work for us. And what this is, is a tear sheet that allows you to get some idea. You put it under a little bit of light here. This is kind of a color by number. So you pick your case from the small nightstands in the single drawer, two or three. And you could do the same thing here with our dressers or credenzas and so on. These are those larger credenzas I was mentioning earlier. And you can see you can do them all with drawers, all with doors and so on. Then you pick your faces on this. So you can pick anything along the way. I've shown you several of these options. And then we have base options down below. Some are in wood, some are in metal. We typically have two or three different metal options. And then we have hardware options below that. And then even hardware placement. So if you'd want a single or double drawer or double placement on a case. Now I'll show you a piece of software. Um, I'm gonna just show you centuryfurniture.com. But as we finish, 
I'm going to go to my PC and I will show you how you can actually configure details case goods and see exactly what this is going to look like for you and your client. We talk about starting at the, fin at the start line and getting as close as we can get to the finish line. The details visualizer and our visualization tools available on centuryfurniture.com are a great head start into this. It allows you to configure the case, pull your hardware, uh, pull your finishes, all of those things and put it on there. The things that you normally had to do on a presentation board, we can now do online and even print yourself or email yourself a wonderful spec sheet with all the specs that you have pulled. That way you don't have to write everything down. All right. Yeah. Now we're going to quickly move. Um, I told you we were covering three different uh, collections, if you will. And the next collection we're going to cover is called Break Room. Um, if you're familiar with our Cornerstone program, Great Room is a, a wonderful segue, basically starting where Cornerstone leaves off, allowing you to create a beautiful transitional to more contemporary upholstery scene. Um, and here is Chuck Houghton um, to introduce it to you. So Chuck is our Vice President of Merchandising that Guy introduced earlier, and I'll let Chuck take it away. Okay, great. So this is great room. This takes over where Cornerstone leaves off. It's a little bit more transitional, contemporary, where Cornerstone is a little bit more traditional to transition. Uh, we have three depths here as well. We have a 40, a 44, and a 48. Shown here is the 48 is the grandest depth. And it takes up a lot of real estate, but it's very comfortable. You can sit back in it, relax. And again, there's three different depths. This is the deepest. This is the 48. There's a 44 and a 40. It comes with uh, a nice four inch uh, bordered cushion. This is a down plush cushion. The backs are, are Everloft back. It has a, a down fiber back in it. It has a nice recovery with the uh, dirt of the Everloft in it. Um, we have um, a really neat feature in the sectional is we've designed it where the cushions are reversible and flippable. So all the cushions are the same size, so you can flip and rotate throughout the sectional. So the armless love seat cushions are the same size as the corner sofa or the armless chair. And then the chaises can be left. There's not a left and right with the T on it, so they can be reversible too if you have two chaises. So that really helps on maintenance and, and flipping your cushions. But it's a really neat grand depth. There's 21 different SKUs in the sectional. Uh, from double chaises to single chaises, armless pieces, corner sofas. Uh, we have seven different arms. They start with a three inch track and go up to a 10 inch track. So we have a three, six, eight, a 10 inch track. We have a nested panel arm and we have a half round and a large scale sock arm. We have uh, 19 different feet. I'll show you a couple of those here. We have a like a wide block foot. Then we also have a wide acrylic foot that sits under there to get more of a little bit of a glam look here. And then we have a number of metal uh, feet. We have polished metal. We have this nice little clip corner, um, polished nickel or uh, polished chrome. Then we have a polished brass as well. And, the, and this little design sits a little proud. So it sits out so you get to see the decoration or the kind of just a, the architectural elements of it. We have it in a pewter and a bronze as well. So we kind of covered our basis, whether you want to take it casual or more sophisticated with the polished looks. Then we have these more artisan looks as well. We have this kind of a striate metal, kind of a linear uh, embossed pattern there in the metal. And then we have this modeled clay. So that we have a pewter and bronze in that as well. But one of the most popular legs on Great Room is what we call the large, the tall wood runner. It runs up the back of the case or up the arm. It can come, and so we'll show you in just a minute around the sectional. So we've also come back and designed a, a low wood runner as well. So we'll introduce that this market in, um, in June. Then we came back and we introduced acrylic. So we'll have these nice acrylic wood run or acrylic runners as well. So we have a high and a low there. So again, there's, a, there's 22 uh, different feet option here. Um, and so let's walk around, come on, let's walk around behind the sectional and I'll show you those uh, wood runners. So it really helps when you float these uh, sectionals in a room, when you have a lot of real estate or a big open family room, you can see the wood runners and they line up a, a, on the backs. They sit in about five inches from each end. So there, there's two per section. So 
Again, we're going to do that. And so the, this is shown in a blonde saroon. So you can get this any, in any of our 75 finishes. So you can put that in a dark, slick uh, melange finish, or you can do it in a, a painted finish from like a Sherman Williams or a Benjamin Moore coloration. Um, Chuck, we had a question that we may want to answer later. It's a specific question about fire retardancy in our cushions and how we achieve that. Yes, uh, I don't have to answer that right now. Uh, we all, we do uh, meet all standards and all safety regulations. We take great pride in that, but I'll get you a specific information. I'll send it to you guys and let you know that for sure what those, what those standards are. The one other thing about the gray room, every arm, almost like if it's a, a, a sofa, you get a 24 inch and a, a pair of 24 inch and a pair of 22 inch uh, toss pillows that come standard with it. If it's a uh, one arm love seat, you get one 24 and one uh, 22. And there's a lot of other things that we design in the rooms. We design great rooms, we design a lot of unique chairs. And we designed them to be a little, little bit lower and slicker. So when you look at these open areas, you look through the room and see that. And then we designed this great new Mesa coffee table in a large, very large scale to sit with these great rooms as well. We designed a new tea chair, which is Tatum. It comes with five different arms. Here it's shown with a scoop arm. We have a straight track, a T track, a half round, and a sloped arm. So uh, here's the tear sheet so you can see all the different arms there, but this was designed almost a chair and a half scale to sit with great room. Okay. And we'll also have a display sofa in great room like we do in Cornerstone that we'll show you in three different depths so you can have that on your floor. It'll be, uh, it'll have a wrap on it with uh, embroidered where it'll tell you the depths that are available, the arms that are available, the feet that are available, the construction in the seats, the construction in the back. So it's a great selling tool to have on your floor and to sell this program from, okay? You guys have any questions? I'll move you over to Mr. Holbrook to talk about Live Edge. Don't see any questions in the chat, so we'll keep moving at this point. So our next category in 4A for Century Furniture is actually our Live Edge tables. And Live Edge for us is a wonderful expansion of our custom capabilities, also falling underneath our category of source. So these are built um, out of wonderful slabs called Guanacosta. Guanacosta is a sustainably harvested lumber out of Central America. And Guanacosta is, comes from these trees that actually are maturing and before they start decaying, we go in and actually have our agent harvest these trees. And that allows for the tree canopy that is cutting out light for the younger trees. It actually allows that canopy to lower just a little bit so the younger trees can actually come up through it. So these trees would decay and actually cause harm to the younger trees if we didn't harvest them. So it's a great story to tell. Lana Costa is a beautiful lumber as you can look down through here. We're doing dining room, console and cocktail table out of this entire program. This one is actually finished in what we call our clear finish. And clear for us actually is just a coat, a protective top coat on this. So all the beauty that you see in the grain here is showing completely through. Comer's gonna pan in on what we call a bow tie. A bow tie is actually what we place when we see a small void coming up through the slab. We'll go in and machine this in, hand place these, and that doesn't allow that void to continue splitting up. So that is not natural part of the wood, but we make this beautiful little inlay to kind of go out with that. We do the dining tables in three different scales. So we do a 86 inch long, and then we also do 108, and we also have a 130 inch. Now you may ask yourself, hey, I've got someone that can only take a 124 inch table. We'll actually take the 130 inch table and cut that down for you. We offer the dining tables in five different bases. The base that we're showing you this is our most popular base. That's our oil rub bronze strap base. I'll walk you over, I wanna show you our textured metal base on this table right here. Really a pretty kind of a strided look on the base here. Coming through and we'll be adding this base to additional styles very soon. But really a kind of pre-texturized metal there. And then this would be our 130 inch top. 
So a little bit of an extended top right here and you can kind of see the life and grain of the tree. No two of these tops will ever be the same. So each one that you select uh, will be your unique thumbprint or its unique thumbprint for you and your client. Now, we've talked about some of the things that make Century different. So the ability to cut the size is certainly one thing. But one of the other things that makes us uniquely different is we realize there's a lot of variety in our live edge, in everyone's live edge. So our designers at Designer Furniture Gallery, Jody and Brett and their team are wonderful. They can log into our website and review our inventory with their designers and pick the exact slab they want for their client. So if their client wants more bow ties or more open voids, they can pick that slab and actually place that slab. Each of those, those slabs have a unique serial identifier, meaning a unique number, and they can actually request that slab to be placed on their table. So that is another unique thing Century does for Live Edge. So beyond cutting to dimension, Century also offers up custom finishing. So we have five different finishes that we offer up and that we think are uh, very pleasing and work qu back quite well. So this is actually our Blonde Ceruse finish. So Blonde Ceruse is actually one we run a lot on oak. So it's a nice kind of open grain here with the Guanacosta, the ceruzing gets caught up. It almost looks like you're looking down into a tidal pool. A beautiful finish here on this wonderful little cocktail table for us. On the bottom, this is our second or actually third base. This is a great little pedestal base we offer up and you can put any of Century's finishes on this. I think this is in maple to contrast here. So we do a lot of painted finishes contrasting back and letting the top be the star here. We have a polished nickel base that takes us a little bit more modern. It's a nice juxtaposition with the live edge top. And we offer these bases up, of course, on the dining as well as the console table. The finish here is actually brownstone. And in brownstone, if you're looking down the grain of this, you can actually see a little bit of the sapwood right here, but it's not nearly the contrast that you would get in the clear or even in the blonde ceruse. The next finish that we have is actually City Light. And City Light for us is something that Thomas O'Brien developed. It's a little bit more of a formal finish, but more of a kind of medium brown. And you can see the sapwood here, as well as the contrast. And then this is the acrylic base. Another beautiful base we have that takes this even more juxtaposition against a little bit more of a modern feel. So the beautiful wood top there with a little bit of a modern acrylic base. And last but not least, Slate gray. So this gives us our fifth option. So slate gray is a little bit of a pigmented finish. So you'll still see the grain. You'll see a little bit coming through and through here. It's a little bit drier finish, but it has a little bit of pigmentation uh, that allows those gray high and low tones to kind of come back and play together. So five different bases, console, cocktail, multiple widths in all of these, and of course the dining table. And then we also offer these cut to size. So if you need something cut to a specific size, we're happy to do that for you. Beyond that, uh, we're also gonna be developing some uh, writing desk based off of these as well, using the dining table bases and a little bit smaller top. So we think we'll have some good play there. And then we may even develop some bar tables off of this as well. As with everything that we do that's highly configurable and customizable, we've got a great little tear sheet that goes with this that just shows you a little couple beautiful room setting shots. And then we actually show you what's offered up. So the dining table and the different options here. We have the cocktail table at 48, 60, and 72 inches and the variable widths in between there. Then the console table over here, we offer that up in a 54 and a 72. Of course, if you needed a custom width in this, we can work with you on that. Different base options down through here. The five different wood choices, or uh, I'm sorry, five different finish choices we have. And then an easy way to write in your ID number for the exact slab you're picking off. And we also have a second choice option in case someone else is right in front of you in line. This has amazed us. It's amazed our case goods team and our production team and even our product development team at how many people have adopted this from Century. We're seeing 20 to 25 of these come through each week. And we thought we'd probably see about half of that. So a lot of excitement around this. I know a lot of people offer up something similar, but it's usually just the clear top on a single base. We allow the designer to make the decision on what best suits their client. 
So that is our Live Edge program and it will continue to expand. Okay. So now we're gonna let Guy drive and he's gonna walk through our visualizer, which he referenced before. And just to show you um, quickly what you can do off of Century's website with being able to um, go in and actually pull up and design your very own details custom cabinet. We also have a visualizer available for our tea chairs, which um, Chuck referenced the newest one here, which is the Tatum. Um, and so I will turn it over. connecting through. Hello, everybody. Guy Holbrook here. Sorry, face for radio. Um, Jody, can you guys hear me okay? I just logged in off my PC. So I think we're good to go. Um, I want to share a quick screen with you here if I can. So let me see if I can do this real quick. Jody, just unmute real quick. I want to make sure my audio is coming through okay. We can hear you great. Perfect. So I'll try to Let use- Let me make you a co-host so you can share your screen. Okay, thank you very much. So what I wanna show with you is a couple things that we offer up here at Century. So let me make sure I can kind of pull this up. Um, this is really kind of a cool feature we have. And this is actually our details visualizer. So what this allows the designer to do is go in and work off of our website. So this is on centuryfurniture.com. It's real simple. Um, and you can actually go through and click and you'll see that we've got uh, source or custom source right here. If you click on custom source, it takes you to all of our custom configurable products. So uh, details case good is the one I kind of pitched early. So in that, this is actually what you, it'll take you to, and you can load an item. So for us, I've got the tall four-door credenza, but you could do the six-drawer load dresser and put that in there. I'm going to stick with the credenza just because I like to have a little bit of fun with this. So that'll load that up for us, and that brings that into the visualizer and allows us to go in and pick hardware, etc. So waiting on the internet, as we often are, we'll see if that kind of comes to fruition. There it is. And what this allows us to do is actually go in and you can pick our box finish. So if I don't like the finish that's on the box, I can take this box and actually put it in a different finish. If I want to go a little bit crazy, I might actually put it in this really bright kind of vivid green. But let's stay back with the desert. I think that's a little bit better. Um, if I want to pick a different front finish here, I can do that as well. Um, if I didn't want to have the coconut that's on there now, if I wanted it all in the same, I could put the whole thing in desert. And then, or I could put it in London Brown and do a dark kind of contrast on this. And let's see if that's hopefully resolving a little bit on your computer screen. So I'm gonna put it back in coconut just because I like it. If I hover over this, actually it will allow this to go in and let me get a good peek at the hardware. And that's a mother of pearl kind of framed in brass hardware for us that I like a lot. And I've put the texturized face on this as well. You can choose different hardwares. Maybe you like an acrylic pull on this. I'm gonna pick up one of the acrylic pulls and just put that on there. And it'll allow you to get an idea of what that looks like on the acrylic pool. If I don't want that, I, again, I'm a big fan of the mother of pearl. Um, so sometimes I kind of leave that on there. So let me see if I can go back and pick that. We've got a great looking tortoise shell that does really nice too. I'm going to put that on there real quick too. Just to give you a nice kind of contrast in these things. So that should be hopefully pulling through. Um, I can pick my hardware finish. So typically we've got an antique brass and a polished nickel. You can probably see that changing on your screen. Now that's the polished nickel that cools it off a little bit. And then hardware placement, I'm just single is the only thing I have here. If I'm on a dresser, I can actually do a double. And maybe I don't like that base. Maybe I'd like to put a metal base on there. So if I wanted to go and put, let's say our polished nickel base, I could do that and change that out for us as well. You know, I like that tapered and the saber leg a little bit better. So I'm going to stay there. So now I've kind of got figured out what I really like. Well, what does that look like from the side and so on? Well, that's kind of cool. That gives me some idea, but I really want to know the dimensions. Oh, there those are. Okay. Right in here at the bottom. And then what I might want to do is say, listen, I've picked these options. What I'd really like to do is take this and show this to my client. So instead of having to go and pick out finish panels and different hardwares and things like that 
and you know print them out all on a board and kind of put it up there i can actually just hit print pdf and hopefully this will load up for us and we can take a look at this so uh, this is actually a great little pdf screen i'm going to just kind of make sure that i've got the right thing shared uh, it did come up so we're good there click out of that so this actually is a great tear sheet we can work back with it tells you the style number down here it tells you all of the options so we picked the case front textured oak desert coconut mother of pearl all of these are the options and you can print this out or you can actually email this to you or your client so a nice easy way as i mentioned earlier to kind of get from the starting point actually to the finish line so it's a great piece of technology we're offering up on our highly configurable pieces uh, not just details case goods but also on uh, our Chesterfield program, which is a great sectional program we have. We also have what we call T-chairs. There's a Tory Trent, Tyler and Tish. So those visualizers are all available underneath that kind of Century source. Um, I wanna point out just a couple other things real quick, uh, hopefully on our Century website. Let me see if I can get back there. Let me back up just a little bit. So I did wanna kind of point out where we are with Century source. Um, and, and the website in general. So if you click here on centuryfurniture.com and make sure that I'm still sharing the right screen here. I am. Basically on this, you can see that we've got living room, dining room, bedroom, but if you click on custom source right here, that link actually takes you to our highly configurable item. So it will take you to our uh, details case goods. It will take you to Cornerstone and allow you to preview all of those highly configurable items and tear sheets for each of those things. So it's a great little thing that allows us to do. Finally, it loaded up. So there's Cornerstone. If you want to view Cornerstone or Chesterfield, these are our highly configurable. Here's the view of the great room. That's what Mr. Chuck Alton did for us. This just tells you a little bit about that program, uh, the different frames that we offer up on great rooms. And you can see we offer the swivel chair, the stationary chair, et cetera, and the sectional choices and all of those configurations. Then here are the arms Chuck was alluding to in his presentation. It was slightly better than mine, but only slightly. Here are the bases that are offered up on the great rooms as well. So we keep all of that kind of under one roof and uh, the fine folks at DFG can certainly help you down this pathway and showcase all of these wonderful things for you. So um, I hope that that has been informative. You know, we do talk about being makers at Century Furniture. We're very proud of that. Uh, we are truly a manufacturer and I mentioned the 800 people that build furniture every day for us in Hickory at our three different plants and Century is uh, you know proudly owned by the Schufer family who own Rock House Farm so we've got some great brothers and sisters in that family as well from Hancock and Moore to Highland House to Hickory Chair um, a lot of great people and a lot of great companies we are in the furniture business and our partners therefore are in the furniture business with us so uh, a big, big thank you to all you fine folks out there in Pacific Northwest. If you have any questions, I've got Chuck right here with me. Homer's right nearby, but uh, we're certainly open to any questions you may have and uh, let us know. Hey guys, this is Jan with the Seattle Design Center. We do have a few questions in the Q&A. Are you able okay. to pull those up? I can see the chat. So I don't know if that's, uh, I don't know that that's it. Yep, I do see Q&A. And let's yeah, see. Yeah, you just click on that. And I'm looking there now. I don't see anything. Yeah, you can just read those to me maybe real quick. So sorry, those are not showing up in my box quite That's yet. okay. Would you like me to read them to you? Uh-huh. And use small words and pictures. That'd be great. Deal. I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> Pat Patricia would like to know, how is fire retardancy achieved in your upholstery furniture? You know, that's a great question. We'll send you the technical docs. I hate to speak out of school. We've got a lot of great links on our website. And if you just want to give me her email address, I'll send her the technical specs. Um, you know, fire retardancy is a funny thing. It, it's changed quite a bit a couple of years ago from Cal 117 compliancy, even in the commercial side, along with the Boston Technical Bulletin 133. So there's a lot of technical information out there uh, that is kind of confusing, but I'll send you to a place on our website that should give you our best answers and our most accurate answers on that. Fantastic. And we've got one more here uh, from an anonymous attendee. In the Live Edge offering, can we order the bases or the tops separately? 
you know, that's a great question. We have folks that certainly uh, are doing their own millwork or have a different source or a unique base or a piece of metal they want to use. Certainly, we will allow us, we call it parent-child. So the, the parent would be, you know, the tabletop and the bases together and the children would be the bases and, and the slab. So we split those up in our price list and those are easily uh, available and quotable through our wonderful rep out there, Wendy Basque, who can take you down the right pathway there. Great question. Great. Does anyone else have any questions they want to pop in the Q&A? Now, I've got the experts with me. I mean, Chuck is right <laughs> here on my left. I've got Comer right here on my right. I mean, you know, it's your got, direct line. I was going to say, I got my lifeline here. <laughs> they get nervous when I start answering questions. Well, just well, we'll give everyone a few more minutes to get any questions in here, but and I, I can actually pop in here. So it's like, it's like a random voice. Hi. Love it. Well done. Good to see you. Um, just so everybody knows, the Seattle Design Center is open Monday through Friday, nine to five. We are accepting walk-ins and uh, appointments are appreciated. So if you want to learn more about Century and all their wonderful offerings, you can head to DFG. And you can see their amazing staff there. Let's see if we've got one more coming in. Yes. Um, can we see, if possible, the glass front details? Sure. Um, so what I need to do here is turn this back over to Comer Ware. So um, what we're what's being referenced here is we've taken another set of details case goods. These are mainly for uh, family and great room areas. And we are doing these, instead of doing the original that we've done in maple, we're now doing these in oak. And we've got some storage pieces that we'll take you through and show. So the cases are oak. And then we're doing five unique faces on the, in reverse painted glass and mirror. And they are absolutely stunning. We are starting to kind of work in this area. We're gonna expand out the offerings. And if you'll uh, rejoin Comer as a host or co-host, she and Chuck are going to take you out and show you several of those uh, that are here in the showroom. And I also want to make sure we show you our large eBay credenza from the, uh, the uh, details case goods on the first introduction. So we'll show you a couple of those things if you'll load up Comer and uh, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll get the band back together and get the talent on the screen. <laughs> great. We'll be back on here in just a moment. That's great. So if there's any other questions, Chuck, anything to add? No, just on the uh, mirrored front pieces we're talking about, we're going to add oak to that. So we're going to do a couple different door prints to this market. We'll keep adding to that. So the, not only will you have the reverse printed glass, we'll have some textured oak and some herringbone oak panels. We'll have uh, some wood oak strips on there. So it gives it more of kind of a casual or a highland or a, a waterside look. And then we'll also be offering like maybe embossed uh, leather to look like crocodile. We'll just keep adding to that um, offering. So Comer's coming up now with uh, one of the pieces she'll show you. you want to I'm going to hide myself so everyone can see that pretty well. All right, Comer, are you pitching? I am right here in front of um, Details Cabinet uh, 2 is what we're calling this. Can you see it, Guy, on your screen? Okay, so as Chuck mentioned, and this has certainly a wider picture frame molding, it's crafted um, out of oak. You can see here it's finished in our um, coconut, I believe, finish. And then as Chuck will point out, touch latch doors, little shelf behind, um, and that's two different bays with those touch latch doors. Um, and then the beautiful, which I hope it's showing up on your screen, but the beautiful glass, um, ugly mosaic, uh, faux chagrin um, look on this cabinet. I would have to run through the showroom to show you the other versions of this, um, but we will absolutely get imagery out your way. Uh, I think this one is stunning here in that coconut finish. Again, you have different leg choices at the bottom. This is shown with a tapered leg. You could put this on the, the metal base and on any of the other bases that come standard with the details custom cabinet program. And I think Chuck pointed out that they will be adding faces to this in the future. And those other faces will take hardware options. With the glass versions, we um, do not have, we do not offer the hardware options. Obviously it would fracture that glass, that mirror panel. 
Fantastic. We do have one more question here from Sandra. How, okay. how narrow can a live edge console table be ordered? Is 12 inches available? We'll have to look into the inventory. We don't stock it at that dimension. Uh, I think we're a little bit deeper than that, Chuck, maybe 14 to 16, 18 inches, but I'm sure that we could find one. So if you had a specific dimension you're looking for uh, or working in a space constraint, I'm sure we could find something for you. We would just need to get an idea of your length on that. That might be the other constraint. And then one other issue is our bases are probably wider than the 14 as well. So if she had her own base, we probably could still supply her a top. Or the wood base might be yeah, easier. We, might could, we could modify a wood base, but the metal bases, I believe, are wider than 14 inches, if I'm not mistaken. So we talked about in the details one case, the ones that are built in maple, kind of a two bay storage. This is the three bay at 108 inches. So you've got a bay here of doors and then a bay of drawers, and then of course another bay of doors here, done in the two-tone. Uh, you can mix and match, match the bases, so these don't have to be readed like this, and this doesn't have to be picture frame like this. Hardware right here, obviously, this variable kind of square pool. But again, 108 inches done in uh, coconut, I think is the actual face here. And then the finish is nude, which is great. Beautiful piece, wonderful as we get into these larger TVs and family rooms, multiple bases offered on this, all the hardware options, including the decorative hardware. So just, just showing you a grander scale of what we've got now. And it has shocked us how many people are actually pulling this in. So we have a large and a small scale size and you can see it actually on this piece. So we've got the larger pools right here, contrasted with the smaller pools. Great catch. So if it you is, want to do this as a six door unit, you can do that as well. We have six, six doors, mm -hmm. or you can do it as nine drawers, or you can have doors there, two banks of drawers, so you can mix and match. You can do all kinds of cool things with this thing. Great. All right. So any additional questions or thoughts? I think we are good. I'm going to pop on here really quick. Thank you so much. And your showroom there looks absolutely beautiful. And if anyone would like to see, I know that uh, DFG has a lot of these pieces in their showroom as well. So if you want to come touch, feel, look, uh, they'd be more than happy to help you out. And I think we're good on the questions. Well, again, again, we just want to thank everybody. DFG is, they are the epitome of what we call a partner showroom. They are great people that understand not just what we do, they understand their customers and they relay their customers' needs to us and they believe in the Century way and we believe in their way as well. So uh, we're thankful for everyone out there and just bring us the opportunity. I promise you we can help you realize it from Century with our, all of our expertise and all of our care. So have a great one. We really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Have a good one.